Okay guys, so this is part two. This is just gonna be really short. I'm just gonna finish the warm reviews here. So this is Grandma Mac and Lancelot and Guinevere. This is Juicy Blackberries and Vanilla Lace Type. I wasn't sure how I was gonna feel about this one because of the blackberry scent. I think I heard, was it Devin that said that it always reminds her of cough syrup? I do get that a little bit, but the vanilla lace really comes through and makes it a really nice, sweet scent. Vanilla lace is a beautiful scent to me. I really, really like vanilla lace. I think what I'm gonna do, I think I might, I have a potion pack of sweater weather, so I'm probably gonna keep this one out, pull out my potion pack of sweater weather and mix the two. I think it'd be a really pretty scent together. So I'm gonna do that. But that one, uh, it wasn't so strong that it was like so overpowering. It was just a nice medium, like medium high scent. Almost done with this guy. This is BCS Oh What A Beautiful Morning. And this is buttermilk pancakes, maple syrup, and sugar cookie dough. Not gonna lie, I would love to have this one again. All I have in here, let's see if I can, let's see if I can, um, I have a rose and like that tiny little piece in there. A rose and a tiny little piece left. <laughs> this one is really great, especially like I love warming this in the morning time, which, seems ironic since it's called Oh What A Beautiful Morning, but it's just like a nice syrupy bakery scent. So if you're not like not in love with like syrupy type scents, you probably, this may, one may not be for you because it is very, it does have that syrup scent going on, but I like it, it's really nice. Next one that I really enjoyed and, uh, cause Cider Lane has been kind of iffy for me this year. I bought a lot of Cider Lane last year and also in D-Sashes throughout the year. And I ended up with a lot of Cider Lane. I was like, oh crap. <laughs> I was like, I have a lot of Cider Lane type scents. So Order the Warrens is the marshmallow, or wait, let's see. Warm Campfire, Green Marshmallow, Glazed Cinnamon Donuts, and Cider Lane. Yeah. So this one is it's Cider Lane, but it's creamed out with the the Order of the Arrow scent. So it makes it really doable and nice. I really like this scent. This one is just a super creamy Cider Lane type scent. And it really, like if you're not a Cider Lane lover, like myself, this one is a really good option if you kind of just want like a fall type scent, but not like crazy. Okay, I also did Jelly Donuts Cookie Monster from Sassy Girl Aroma. This is fresh baked sugar cookies topped with a gooey marshmallow with sugar, fried dough, sweet vanilla, and strawberry jam. I was really liking this one. The strawberry jam in here though was kind of popping out a little bit more than everything else. So I was really getting strawberry jam and I was kind of like, I was liking it, but the strawberry just kept like punching at me and I was just like, I don't know if I like that strawberry. I, for some reason, my nose is getting really weird with strawberry scents lately. So I'm gonna try this one again and see how it goes. And then also I have hazelnut marshmallow fluff lattes. This is crushed hazelnuts, loads of sweet fluffy marshmallow with caramel and coffee. This one is great. I just used a little bit. I'll probably use some more this morning. Oh, that just smells so good. This one is like a hazelnut coffee. I love hazelnut. It reminds me of when I used to drink a lot of hazelnut flavored coffee. I loved that scent in the morning time. Also, I am working on my sidekick. This is my chopped up sidekick of coconut cola marzipan cookies. So this one I need to warm again because I really don't remember. Like, I just remember this being a really neutral scent. Like, I, I don't remember anything sticking out to me like as far as scent so that's why I need to warm it again because honestly I just don't I mean it's got a lot going on it's a crazy scent blend so you would think something would kind of like come out but to me it was just good I, I don't know like I didn't have a love or hate for it 
but I definitely need to warm it again because I just I don't really remember what notes stood out to me but I do remember it was a nice strong scent wasn't offensive I yeah I, it was just kind of a neutral scent I don't remember it that well so I'm gonna rewarm that guy again and I think this is the last thing that I have I have Pita, which is French baguette, butter brickle, and coconut shavings. This is one of my favorites. I have two sidekicks in this bad boy, so <laughs> I plan to mix a lot of pita with cider lane type scents just so that I'm not, um, you know, since I don't love cider lane, I find that mixing this is really great to mix with those types of scents. And Oh, this one is just so good. If you've never tried pita and you like bready bakery type scents, this one is great. I love it. It's like kind of kind of like P.F. Chang's, but it's, well, no, it's, it's not even like P.F. Chang's. But, I mean, they're similar in that they're both like kind of bready notes, but P.F. Chang's is a lot sweeter and more cinnamon. This one is more of a, it's like a, a sweet bread, but it's stronger. It's like you get a lot of the French baguette, so... That one's really great. Nice and strong. Okay, that is it, you guys. That is my warm reviews for this week. I will be pulling a fall basket probably this weekend. I'll just be pulling things out of my bigger fall bin. And yeah, so I should be back with that on Monday. Yeah, on Monday. Okay, I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you guys have warmed any of these scents, please let me know and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.